Starfield is ever so close, uh, and you know, thank you so much for that spectacular performance. Really appreciate you coming all the way for this. Uh, it's true, in just over a week, fans will start to play Starfield in early access on Xbox and PC. Well, I've been lucky enough to start playing it, don't be jealous, uh, I'm not allowed to say anything about it. Uh, yes, exactly. Okay. All right, well guys, Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much, guys. Really disappointed. They're disappointed. That's just so disappointing. This is such a special night for so many developers, and it's really disappointing to see someone uh, act that way. But we're going to move right on with the show. We've got a lot of great games to show you. Really, it just, it's just so sad to me to see something like that happen. A night we're here to celebrate games and this community and how much they mean to us. So. Without further ado, um, I want to move right on with the show because we've got a lot to show you. And the good news, Gamescom, is we have someone very special here who can be here to talk about Starfield. Please join me in welcoming to Opening Night Live and Gamescom for the first time ever one of our industry's greatest creators, the director and executive producer of Bethesda Game Studios. That's right, Todd Howard, everybody. <laughs> Todd, thank you so much for coming all this way to Gamescom. Uh, we have a lot to talk about with Starfield, but first of all, is this true this is your first ever time at Gamescom? This is my first Gamescom, and you were right. You said how great the crowd is here, and it really... <laughs> and just all the fans that come here for this biggest, the biggest convention in gaming to celebrate games, and I figured, you know, it is our first new franchise, in over 25 years, so if I was going to come, you know, it's for Starfield. Well, uh, we all welcome you to Gamescom in Germany, and we're all very excited to step into this new world, Starfield, uh, and the next week, Early Access. Set up for people, why did you want to make this game, Starfield? Why did you want to create a new world? You know, I think like a lot of gamers out there, we have dreamt of a game where we look to the skies and we can blast off into space and explore. We love to make games where we can explore these worlds we've done, like with the Elder Scrolls, and the Fallout series, but we wanted to do something brand new where you could explore with complete freedom in the galaxy. It's a game we've always wanted to play that um, we think a lot of people wanted to play as well. It's kind of that, that dream game. Yeah, I, I wish I could talk about it, but uh, it's, it's quite an experience, and I know everyone here is very excited to, uh, to jump in soon. Um, you did bring some stuff to Gamescom to show to fans. I know there's a theater. Tell us, I know you've been, you know, sharing a little bit about the game, but I know there's a lot you want people to discover when they play it. What did you bring here to, uh, to Gamescom? Yeah, it's really cool. They, uh, we've built a 300-person seat theater where we're actually showing the beginning of the game, and you start out as a miner, and you, you touch this artifact that affects you in some way where you see a bit 
into space-time, and then you get to create your own character. Our games are about creating and being whoever you want, and then you're off on adventure. Yes, uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, this adventure. I know, uh, you know people have been wondering kind of what the, the main quest line is going to be after you create your character, which is something that I know. I saw even someone on the internet this week created you, I think. Did you see that? Someone tweeted out a picture. They had somehow figured I out. I see a lot of things on the internet. I don't know. I'm not sure that's real. <laughs> well, the thing is, I think you could literally create you know, whoever you want and then enroll yourself into this adventure. And tell us about sort of how the adventure starts. What can we expect? Well, you jump off, you're joining Constellation, which are the last kind of group of space explorers like NASA meets Indiana Jones searching for these artifacts. But the story goes a lot of places. The game has a lot of surprises that we haven't talked about. I don't want to spoil them here, yes. um, but really, really happy with how the story turned out and, and where it goes. Yeah, it's, uh, it's such an epic experience and, and you and your team have done so much for this industry and uh, the fact that you guys have worked through COVID, building this and, and coming out on the other end, uh, we're so excited for everyone to get a chance to play it. So thank you for all you've done for our industry, Todd. Everyone, Todd Howard. Thank you. Can't wait for you to play the game. Thanks so much, Todd. Really appreciate it.